Welcome back, Lancey Matta. Did it get you into the dancing spirit a little bit? Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Why not? Why not? It's nice outside. It's beautiful. It is gorgeous. We're, we're going to break a record today for sure. Did you know Supposed that? Let's get 19. Yeah, and our old record is 14.4, set in 1958. Wow. Which is like a big record to break. Yeah, I thought this morning was really warm. I went right. To work. Days like today, you could grow vegetables outside. You could. Do you like my segue? Yeah. But normally at this time of the year, and as we go, it's not going to be easy to grow anything outside with our sub zero temperatures that we look forward to. That's why the urban cultivator is available. Yes, this is a really cool product. I actually met the uh, inventor in Kelowna. We had a summit there, mm -hmm. and he actually brought the unit sitting there. And it was so astonishing that, you know, this thing that was everybody would ask right away. You know, they've got fluorescent lights in it, and so yeah. almost like a, almost like a dishwasher with greens right. in it. Really, we should show the video so people yeah, know what we're talking about. Yeah, the video's really cool. Here it is. Look at that. It's yeah. almost like a beer fridge, but with vegetables. Exactly. You know what? And people are going to ask, like, are you guys growing? Your lettuce or your you know cabbage or whatever or mm -hmm. your spices and stuff right absolutely um and this was um the segment that, that they had on was on dragon's den okay ago, right? these guys were on dragon's den yeah absolutely and, and did they get money from the dragon's they den? totally loved them yeah oh, it was cool. really good nice. so the fairmont hot springs hotel a bunch of hotels in vancouver your booster juice is on board with it um everybody's getting more involved because in the long run from a commercial point of view restaurants yeah it's going to save you money Right, if and, you can grow things on hand. And if you can market, like, you know, you're eating live greens within two and a half weeks. Right. No shipping costs or anything like that. Right, so. like, did we just cut your greens five minutes ago? Absolutely, and you can show them, right? You know, it's a, it, it looks really good, too. So it's taking off in the commercial industry, the commercial sector. Yes. But what about people at home? Are they buying these and saying, I'm going to grow all of my spices indoors in the winter? Yeah, I think there's a lot of people that are into, you know, think green, right? Yeah. No GMOs and that stuff. You have a two and a half week, uh, and then you're going to have a whole bunch of uh, spices or whatever. Mm -hmm. I tasted it. Actually, in Kelowna, mm -hmm. some of the spices, and it's uh, it's really, really good. Yeah. Like it's um, like eating live greens. Yeah, it's really cool. And how involved is it? Is it hard to do? No, it's, right? it's just, just like a dishwasher uh, application install. Basically, you just need to uh, have your plum and water and that stuff. It's a, on a timer, right? So it actually tells you when the water and that stuff, how much light you want to put in there. Uh, cosmetics on it you can change the decor of it yeah so if you have like different color walls and that stuff and you want to camouflage it they can have trims you can put uh, chopping blocks on there there's mm -hmm. a whole bunch of different uh, types of chopping blocks thick ones uh, different colors and that stuff you can add that to the equation and I think it's a really cool thing. I think probably also was, the appeal is for people who live in big cities, perhaps, that don't have access to a garden or a community garden, and they still want to grow inside, whether it be summer or winter. This would be a, a Yeah, good this would be a good thing, right? And anybody who's really healthy and, and mm -hmm. right on that health bandwagon, mm -hmm. they're going to they're gonna, they're gonna go do this, right? And now the residential piece is out. Mm -hmm. um, they're supposed to be available just at the end of December, so mm -hmm. just uh, after Christmas. And uh, the commercial one is already out anyway. Okay, so well, it's kind of cool. You guys don't have them in stock now, but you will. Is that right? Yes, we have them. Uh, we ha we can order them. We can order that all can the be seeds, ordered anytime. everything. Really, yeah. right all down the to the seeds. All the components, all the chocolate hmm. blocks, everything. So it's kind of cool. Very healthy. All right, labs. Thank you for telling us about this. Thank you. Have the new, latest and greatest in staying healthy. Uh, speaking of staying healthy, we're going to be also talking about farm to school. It's a great program uh, in Camels and other communities. That's coming up in a little bit. But uh, coming up next, we have Michelle Mistel joining us from Real Deals on Home Decor. Stay with us.